Luxus Dragnet. Hello guys, and welcome back to my channel. Now we are going to watch another episode of this cultural anime that was recently released after the previous episode that I just uploaded to my channel, so without further ado, let's get started right away. When he got a call from her auntie that Kiri was supposed to be home now but she couldn't because of the heavy rain, he checked outside through the window and confirmed the rain was pretty heavy, but when he was about to leave, he noticed Kiri was standing outside of her apartment and also very wet because of the rain. And Kiri also noticed him on his window, so she greeted him, and after that, she spotted him. After he let Kiri enter her apartment to dry herself, he immediately taunted her because, after that, he lectured Kiri on why she still had the courage to come to her, and he even said that she might change too much. But then he told Kiri that she was still a kid inside of her, so then he told Kiri that after she dried, she should go straight to her house after this. Kiri was saying to her mind that she should go home before the rain starts to drop, and her brother was also worried because if they see him having a girl in her apartment, that will be her big problem if that happens to her. He asked Kiri if she had a phone, so Kiri answered that her phone was in the bag. 12 seconds later. She literally noticed that he was acting weird now after she just reached her phone on the ground, and because her brother saw something unexpected, he was literally surprised, so she couldn't hold it, and then she started teasing, asking him why she was twitchy about. Damn! And when Kiri was close enough to see him, she started to laugh harder, saying, You literally always treat me as a kid, but you just come from her feet and serve you dumbass. And that will be the end of this video guys. Stay tuned for another new video that I will upload tomorrow. With that said, thanks for watching, and please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.